protege, Bobby Womack, who was only 20 years old. Bobby was wearing Sam's suit. But because he was only 20 and he didn't have his parents' permission, they had to wait till he was 21. So a month later, they officially tied the knot. And look at this. It says, Sam would want it this way. What? Bobby Womack's family? Mad. Sam Cooke's family? Furious. In fact, some of Sam's brothers beat Bobby up. This is a huge scandal. What a betrayal. They're married. And then they have a son, Vincent Womack, who later at the age of 21 unalived himself. But you guys, it's not over. In 1970, Barbara walks in to see Bobby in bed with her 17-year-old daughter, Linda. Sam's daughter, Linda. So wearing his suit was not good enough. Marrying his wife wasn't good enough. He had to have his daughter? Barbara gets a pew-pew, fires it at Bobby, grazes his head. Obviously, they split up, and Barbara and Linda never speak again. But it's not over. Linda Cook, Sam Cook's daughter, then married Bobby's brother, Cecil. Cecil frickin' Womack. And then they performed together under Womack and Womack. How messy is this entire thing? 